Major Slack Attack. Well, yeah, the name is Slack. Thanks for coming back. Let's walk through some more Skyrim. Lazy Argonian, our boy the Lizard King here is about to go on a special op with Talbus to Travis Watch. We want to acquire the Detect Life spell so that we can power level up to um, Alteration 70. It's just a couple of uh, a couple of levels, but that um, Detect Life spell will also be useful for other things. Yeah, no, get that up to 60 and then we go on a skill book run and get it up to 70. That's the plan, let's do it. Trava's watch is down here. Let's just get rid of the custom marker. Stop that. Here, wait a minute. Remove. There we go. Trava's watch. Did we discover it yet? Yeah, we did. Let's just go right there. Okay, uh, let's get some light on the subject here. That looks good. Alright. Talvis. I got a special job for you. Oh, you're activated already? Good. You keep those guys busy. That's exactly what I... I wanted to tell them to go over there and just kind of like, you know... Okay. Keep those guys busy and I can go talk to... Uh, What's his name over here? Great. He's not activated by any hostile. No, 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 we're gonna have to do this back asswards. This happened to me in a practice run. Um, these guys want to remain like, you know, hostile and it's gonna be like that, like forever in a day. Yeah, if this happens to you, this is one option. It's this right around here. Okay, Scrap, you wanna be a war horse? Go ahead, get into it. Get into it, Stormy. And Stormy, too. And I think I have some. Uh... Yep, here we go. One of those, and one of those. Let's make that number five. And let's make this number three. Five, poison boat, that is correct. Make these guys more vulnerable to shock and... Gotcha, all right. <laughs> You're stuck, aren't you? Dude! Dude, oh! Boy, did he fly. Okay, and Stormy and Stormy too are busy. Busy, okay, um... And let's hook this up too. One of the main reasons why I acquired this is so that we don't have to spend Magicka. Oh jeez, I was looking at uh, Scrap down there and I thought he died. Okay, that would be catastrophic. Get out of the way, Scrap. We got this. Ah, jeez. Okay. All right, no, 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 what now? <laughs> oh no, you don't. Here we go. <laughs> like literally, blow him away. Enough. You damn near killed me, dude. 
He's down here, Stormy. Finish him off. Yeah, I've heard that before. Okay. Um, that was hellacious. Okay, like I said, we're gonna have to do this back asswards. Now, we'll ride back, talk to Stalio. <laughs> and he'll still be under the impression that he needs to uh, do his fort mission, and he's gonna give it to us. The mission called Infiltration, and then we'll just go through the steps of opening the gate and letting him in the front. We won't tell him it's all done, though. Great, he's sitting there. <laughs> uh, who knows where Talos... There he is. Okay. Now, calm. Don't do anything host Like, you know? Don't engage Stalio. I will take back my family's castle. What's going on here? Hustle it up. Finally, re I was expecting more, though. Okay, I'm the best. I'm just rushing through this dialogue before he goes hostile again. But to invade my home. Do you have a plan? The front gate is locked. So you'll need to use the mine entrance behind us. Okay. Open the front gate. And we'll try and give you some support. Got it. I'll do it. I wish we could all... Good luck. We're on it. Okay. Now, you have to go through these motions. First of all, you have to go through the uh, the tunnel. This is necessary. Then you get the new objective. Use the lever to open the gate to Traver's watch. And now you just go back out. Right around. The same way we did. Up and over. This way, Talvis, we're going for a little run. Work on your cardio. Come on, let's go. Sorry, I was trying to drink my coffee and drive at the same time. Okay, here we go. You're supposed to work your way through the uh, the complex, you know, go in the tunnel and then kill all the bandits. But this is another way of doing it. Just go up and over, down into the courtyard here, find the lever, hit it, opens the front gate, and Stalio should be there. There he is. And then, uh, you know, since it's all clear, here's Stalio. The fort is yours. <laughs> Thank you for your help. Hey, no problem. Did you see my family inside? Inside? Uh. No, I didn't see them in there. <clears throat> Hopefully they made it to safety before. Yeah, I sure hope so. I'll begin the search after a quick restock. Okay. Anyway. My reward? Your reward. Here we go. Thanks again. You're welcome. He gives you the spell tome of the tech life. Thank you very much. Let's eat that right away. Very well, nice uh, alteration spell. And our work here is done. All right, Talos, good job, outstanding. Let us go to Riften. Cast the Detect Life spell in a busy market to level up Alteration to 60, and then we'll go on a skill book run. What time is it? Yeah, it's pretty good time. Yeah, here we go. I should have gone and gotten the mage stone, but uh, all right, give me some more magicka. Let's try this again. Come on, give it to me. Here we go. Sixty, and we leveled up. And you know what? I think I recall we're gonna have to take it up to sixty-one. Two, three, v yeah, sixty-one. Let's just level up. Let's throw a few points into Magica for a change. 
Anybody still around? Oh, you got your jewelry back. Hey, how about that, Medesi? You restocked. Good for you. Good on you. <laughs> I heard you were a victim of uh, a robbery. There you go. Alteration 61. Done and done. Okay, Alteries and Skillbook Runs begins in Winterhold. First of all, let's grab some Frost Salts from our stockpile of ingredients at the College of Winterhold. Oops. Jeez, that wrong shout. That could have been catastrophic had anybody been in the way. Okay, yeah, sorry about that. Don't tell anyone, okay? Frost salts. One, please. Very good. Like I said, first uh, alteration skill book can be found in Winterhold at Kralder's house, which is the last house on the left here. Usually open in the morning. Sometimes, yeah. Oh, it's open now. Great. The Alteries and Skill Book is right in this basket here. Just pick it up. Dump it out. Read it. I'll steal it. And Alteration up to 63. Next! Brandy Mug Farm, right near Windhelm Stables. Has an Alteration Skill Book. Usually open in the evening, eight to ten in the evening, and it is. Oh, we just have to wait a couple hours. Very good. Can I help you? Uh, I just came to check out some of your reading material on top of the fireplace here. Daughter of the Nibbin. All right, alteration up to sixty-five. Next, Steam Scorch Mine in Kynesgrove. Have we been there yet? Huh, we haven't even been there yet. How about that? Okay, let's go for a little run. You should discover Kynes Grove. Very good. Once in Kynes Grove, simply wait till about six in the morning. Right about now. We're looking for a dark elf called Dravinia, who is she behind? Be behind the counter here. I think I overshot it. Overshot the time. Ah, uh, dang it. Let's just see if she shows up here. Nope. Okay. Like she's either wandering around here or she's already in the mine. Dravinia. You know what? We should collect all these uh, 
fly Amanita anyways while we're here. <laughs> I love the alarm behind that. Boy, she is nowhere to be found. She should be here by now. There she is. Dravinia. Oh, no reason to stop in Kynesgrove. Keep moving. I came to see you. Um, what do you do in Kynesgrove? Nosy one, huh? I was a mage back in Morrowind. I lend my talents to the mines here, helping them keep the tunnels safe. By Azura, it gets hot in there. I use frost salts for a potion to keep the heat bearable, but I'm out. No. Yeah, I could find some for you. If you want to go to the trouble, feel free. I suppose I could offer you a bit of free alteration training when you get back. No, yeah, that'd be great. Okay. Here you go, I have them. I have to have some on me right now. Well, well. You actually did what you said you were going to do. I'm impressed. All right, Here, make for the alteration let me training. Let a thing or two about alteration magic. It's the least I can do. And shut them. There we go, up to 66. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Good day. Nice doing business with you. Let me just finish collecting the fly Amanita. I missed a couple. Should be 21. Still here. You lead, I'll follow. There, got them all. Excellent. All right. Next. Snow shot farm. No, we don't do that kind of stuff. Seen the remnants of the grove. Mining's for chumps. We're at Dragonborn. Uh, Snowshot Farm. In the basement is another alteration skill book. This is open typically in the morning. So, uh, like around 7. Ready, babe? Now. There we go. And Stay away open. From what? It's open. <laughs> he came in. What does the dragonborn do once he's been summoned by the Greybeards? Can the Thum be taught like any skill? He sneaks around people's home and checks out their reading material. <laughs> That's what he does. And one more. This is easily found at the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary. You want a mic? Right here. 
There we go. Alteration 70. We can take this one. All right. So we now have magic resistance three. We desperately need that. It's a done deal. Next. Tal, is he still around? Uh-oh. Ready to go. Does he not, like, enter the Dark Brotherhood Sanctuary? There he goes. Okay. What, are you afraid of the Dark Brotherhood? You're a Dark Elf. Come on, dude. What the hell? <laughs> Backing away slowly. <laughs> okay. Um, I discovered the perfect getup for the Lizard King. It's some hide armor. I was looking for some kind of, like, clothing that shows off his green skin, but, you know, um, at the same time, gets people to stop accusing him of being naked. It's some hide armor, and one of these guys over at the White River Watch always seems to have some hide armor. Let's go whack him and get that. Butterflies here too. We could use some of those. All right, let's go. Okay, let's just sneak right up here. Pop in a little stormy action. And another one. And I probably have a... Uh... Yep. Who wants some recharging? You're the squeaky wheel that gets the grease. Whoops. He's got it. There we go. That's the one we want. Hide armor. Did you kill him? But wait a minute, Aaron. Ow, ow. Get oh, got his soul. Her soul, rather. Excellent. You have hide armor too. Do you? No, studded armor. That doesn't work. The hide armor was the best. Okay, so mission accomplished. Okay, and that's going to be our business gear. There we go. Wait, no. There we go. Haha. <laughs> Excellent. So he shows off his green skin, but he's no longer naked. There we go. Okay, mission accomplished. That's it. Um, now basically uh, we're going shopping, and this is pretty uh, pretty routine. Yeah, we're gonna have to go shopping and uh, buy the following enchantments. I'll just put a list up on the screen. Fortify Alchemy, Fortify Lock Picking, Fortify Carry Weight. That one is uh, optional. Fortify Stamina, Resist Magic, Resist or Fortify Heavy Armor, Fortify Conjuration, Resist Fire, and Resist Frost. I think that about covers it. We already have Fortify Archery. Oh, we have Fortify Conjuration. And Resist the Magic. What we could do is collect a whole bunch of... Dragon's Tongue to go along with that uh, Fly Amanita. Right here in Kynes Road. As you do it. Lots right around the end. That's two, three, four, five, six, seven. So 
somewhere in the camp uh, campsite here. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Easy to find around here. And let's just go up by the road. Thirteen. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. I hear dragon and twenty one. They're very good. Next, um, Honey Strand Cave. Is that it? Yep, that's it. Let's go there. And collect some bees. First of all, I have to take care of a little bear problem. <laughs> He's toast. He's <laughs> got everything coming at him. Dude. Dude. Okay, everybody calm down. And I can see here are some bees. Not the most ideal time to collect bees. Uh, how about um, bright and early in the morning? Hopefully it's going to be a sunny day. Good. Lots of bees around here. Zip. Some can be found in the beehive there. There's another beehive over here. That sound is so realistic. I always find myself wanting to swat my ears. There's another one over there. There's one here. 21. That's good. Okay, we're good. Okay, so we now have um, the means to make some power potions to pay for whatever merchandise we need to acquire to build our combat suit. And first of all, our business suit. Um, did I say fortify alchemy? Yeah, that's pretty much first on the list. Yeah, for the business suit, we are going to need Fortify Alchemy and Fortify Smithing, at the very least. And we can augment it with a little bit of Fortify Stamina. That's not necessary, though. We don't have any of those. One thing we could do, uh, this was glitching out of me recently though, so I don't know if this is reliable. Let's go to Dawnstar.
and talk to Frida, the alchemist, and see if she can, we can get, get her to give us the mission to retrieve the Ring of Pure Mixtures, which will send us to uh, one of uh, half a dozen random locations. <coughs> random locations, pardon me. The mortar and pestle makes potions, if you can't tell from the name. No, I don't have anything for bad names, so don't ask. How'd you pick up the herb trade? If she gives you this option, you can get her to give you a mis miscellaneous husband, quest. We used to go out into the wilds and collect ingredients together. He used to call me his pretty juniper. It's quite romantic, if you're an alchemist. Frost took the old fool a few seasons back while he was looking for the ring of pure mixtures. Pure mixtures, all right. I found the ring's resting place after he died. But I'm far too old to go exploring some cave now. Okay, I could find that ring for you. Well, aren't you sweet? I'd be happy to give you some alchemy training in exchange for the ring if you bring it to me. Done and done. Forsaken cave, good. Okay. If you find that ring, bring it here. Okay, quiet now. We're going to leave. And that is coming up next video. Um, for you, it may be a completely different location. I got the Forsaken Cave, so that's where we're going to, we're going to go plowing through the Forsaken Cave. Retrieve the Ring of Pure Mixtures, and then I'll show you how to acquire it from Frida afterwards so that we can disenchant that and use that. Um, to help build our business gear. That's what's coming up next video. I want to thank you all very much for watching. And if you thought this video was remotely entertaining and or informative, hey, you know what to do. Give your old slackster a big old thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel to make sure you get all my videos hot off the press. All right, stay safe, people. And wash those hands. And um, I'll see you next video. Hey guys, real walkthroughs like these are an endangered species here on YouTube. For a complete lowdown on the YouTube video game walkthrough scene, check out my Patreon page and please consider making a donation to yours truly, Major Slack, to help keep real walkthroughs alive on YouTube. You can donate as little as $1. That's $1. That's all. That's all it takes. Alright? Thanks a lot. Really appreciate it.